so today everyone we have here the topic LRC or HRC okay so this is another method for uh, error detection okay so HRC is the horizontal redundancy checking or that is also the longitudinal redundancy checking okay so we have here an even uh, problem okay so the problem says determine the BCS of the given data string and use a parity for LRC or HRC transmission okay for HRC and LRC transmission and uh, error detection okay so the first data string is 101011 and zero okay so to solve for the LRC okay so we have to count the number of one okay so we use add parity so therefore the parity the number of one must be an add number okay so take note using the add parity the number of one must be an add number okay so let's count okay so one one or one two three four so therefore the parity bit is zero okay then for bit number one so one two one so therefore this is an odd number okay so therefore the first bit okay so take note okay so let's a correction or correction one two three four so that is an even number so to become R, so write 1 as your add parity. This is your add parity. The next, 1, 2, 3, 1. So 1. So therefore, the uh, add parity is 0. 1, 2. So therefore, your parity bit is 1. The next, 1, 2. So therefore, the parity bit is 1. 1, 2, 3, 4. So therefore, the parity bit is 1. For bit number 5, so we have 1, 2, so therefore the parity bit is 1. And the next, for bit number 6, 1, 2, so therefore the parity bit is 1. Okay? And the next, we are going to uh, find the block check sequence. Okay? So the block check sequence, so therefore the block, block check sequence is... BCS of the given data is first bit, so first bit, of course, there is significant bit, so 1, 0, 1, 0, 1, 1, 0. This is your first data string, so this is your LSB, and this is your MSB. Take note that is that this is a 7 bit code so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 so 7 bit code okay the next we have second bit a second data string is 1 0, 0, 1, 1, 1, 0 so this therefore this is your second data string so then and the 1 is your LSB and 0 is your MSB Okay. For the third data string, that is 1, 0, then 1, and then 0, 1, 0, 1. So 0, 1, 0, 1. So therefore, this is your third data string. This is your LSB, and this is your most significant B. And then the fourth data string is 1, 1, 0, 1. So 1, 1, 0, 1, and we have 1, 0, 1, 1, 0, 1. So therefore, this is your fourth data string. So this is your LSB, and this is your MSB. And then the last, that is your LRC or HRC. So this is your LRC or HRC, okay? So 1... 0 and 1, 1, 1, 1, and 1. Okay? So, so therefore, your block check sequence is the first 
data string, second data string, third data string, fourth data string, and your LRC or HRC will be appended to your uh, data string, to all your data string. Okay? So then the direction of time, direction of transmission is, this is the direction of transmission time, this is the time, okay? Of course, per, uh, per data string, the significant bit, and this is the direction of the transmission, okay? So this is the direction of the transmission, so this is the receiver, and this is your transmitter. Transmitter will uh, transmit the first data string in this direction, and of course this is the time of transmission. This is the time of transmission and this is the flow of your data. This is the time of time of transmission. Transmission. And this is the uh, uh, direction. Direction of data flow. Okay. So this is the direction of the data from least significant bit to your most significant bit of your LRC. Okay? So first data strain, the least significant bit up to the most significant bit of your LRC or HRC. Okay? So again, the transmitter and the receiver shake hand or agree for LRC or HRC, okay, they, they shake hand, so they agree for uh, ad parity, ad parity error detection, okay, so ad parity error detection, okay, so this is the transmission of the data using LRC or HRC. Okay? So I hope you understand the discussion through this video and God bless us all. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe to our channel.